I think it's a good career choice because there's a, there's a place for women in welding. It's a good time to get into it. There's a big opportunity for a lot of growth. Companies have started to see the value of females and that uh, are putting them in positions and, and giving them opportunities that are so different and so wonderful. I love it because it makes me confident. I'm excited about welding because it was something that I excelled at and I was very well financially compensated for. Sometimes perceptions are not the reality. When I first meet people that have no clue who I am or what I do and I tell them I'm a welder, they are completely shocked. The always thought is, but you're a woman. And I'm like, yes, I can be a welder as a woman. There's that perception that only men can be welders and it's not true. I decided to go through the, or use the trade assistance program that was offered at the time and go to school. I had no idea what to, to take. Uh, the only thing I knew was that I didn't want to sit behind a desk. I went to a traditional school, a four-year program, expecting to have a sit-down job with amazing salary and benefits. Turned out that, that was not, I was not getting paid what I wanted to get paid. And I actually can make more money, have more opportunities, and there are more jobs out there for welding. I decided to teach welding so I could introduce, inspire, and encourage students to try out welding no matter who they were or what their background is, that they could probably excel at it, even if they don't think that they can. Companies have found by cleaning up their facility that, they, uh, that their workers have more pride. It uh, has less reworks, so then that affects their bottom line. So they have uh, started putting emphasis on keeping things clean. They, and, and a way to keep it clean is to brightly paint it and keep it brightly lit because then the dirt is more obvious. So all of these things are uh, making it such that the dark, dirty, and dangerous is grown more. Welding and manufacturing is a great career choice for women because it takes highly skilled workers to be able to perform the job and not so much in the physical aspect anymore. I love it more than anything. So it's one of those jobs that they tell you, do what you love because then it's not going to work. That's what I have. I mean, I really excelled at it and I was just so excited because there's people that have been welding for years and they'd be getting C's and D's in the class. So it's like, I'm brand new at this and I'm doing so good. There's so much opportunities in it and so many different things you can do with welding. For one thing, the, the pay is good. Another thing is it's fascinating. You know, your, your day is not ever the same. Uh, you never have a problem with being bored. Uh, there's always something to do, something to explore, something to, to try different. Um, most manufacturing companies have their systems of doing things, but uh, oftentimes uh, they haven't had a woman really look at it. If I could give women advice about being a welder, would be to don't let anyone discourage you and do not let the machine intimidate you. It's not as bad as everyone has ever made it out to be. I work in a garage, big, huge job. Garage doors open, sun shining in all day. and You can't beat that. that that's just amazing to me that I get paid to do that. I have had a lot of women come into my class, classes and said, well, we saw a woman was the instructor, and so we thought, well, maybe we could do it too. And so it's just been surprising the number of people that have said, since there was a woman instructing, we took the class too as a woman. I would definitely suggest the welding. It's so much different what, than what people really think. And um, I, I really don't think women ever think of a job like that, and they really need to. I just think I get a lot of respect for the work I do, and that makes you feel good.